Hello everyone. Um, I just got finished doing the skincare video. Um, that's gonna go up probably before this. I'm trying to pre-record some videos and I just got an Ulta order in from the 21 Days of Beauty that I, the day I have ordered so far. And let me put the free gifts to the side and we'll do those last. I got quite a few free gifts. That's not one. These aren't ones, I believe. That covered everything. Okay. The mask I just used, I bought another one of them. Okay, first I will do the skincare that I got. We have a Miss Spa Detox Facial Sheet Mask. I'm taking this with me when I go see Jason because the water and my skin there don't get along. I also got, this is the one I just took off, is a Tony Moly Collagen Elasticity Mask. I love this. I'm trying to see if you use it so often if it actually starts to show a difference in your skin's appearance and the other one is age defy by miss spa they were on sale okay next we will go into the elf products that's how I, how i will do this we will do the elf products and i will show you the free gift that you get for buying so much money worth of elf the first thing is beautifully bare my favorite um, setting spray that I was out of. The one that smells like coconut. I'm telling y'all, this is the third one. Third or fourth one. I love it. It's my ride or die so far. Alright. The next thing is the e.l.f. HD Powder and Sheer. I think this is the one I like the most and I don't have but I could be wrong because it looks like it's the same container this is HD though. hold on nope this was just regular one says HD and one is regular okay so this is the regular one I'm putting it in the drawer as I go and putting the boxes up then I got this elf triangular buffing brush it is for flat top brush triangular shape targeted application of foundation I wanted to try a elf brush that was not as expensive as those other two the it cosmetics and the morphe one to see if it would work just as good putting your foundation on it is smaller compared to the Morphe, which looks really bad right now because I used it yesterday, and this is actually clean and hasn't been used. I don't know why. They do stain when they have white bristles, so maybe the black bristles would be better. So we got that because I wanted to try that out for y'all. And the free gift you get for buying, I think it was $15 worth of e.l.f. products, is the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer, and that is going to go in a giveaway. Probably the Christmas one. I'm not sure. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right. The next thing is Maybelline. Mm. We have the Maybelline Lasting Fix Makeup Setting Spray 16 Hour Wear Setting Spray. It kind of smells like the um, Urban Decay All Nighter. We will see. All right, and we also I decided to get a slim brow pencil from Maybelline as well. And if you bought fifteen dollars worth of stuff from them, you got a free colossal mascara so this is going to go in a giveaway because i believe i have the full size i'm not sure 
but even if I don't, I have like 50 mascaras in the drawer, so this is going to go one of the giveaways. Okay, the next thing, we're just gonna put the setting spray over there and the brow pencil up there. Okay, next, we're gonna go into the Too Faced. I have the two palettes that I said I was going to get for you for the Christmas giveaway. I have the Too Faced Pineapple Palette. That smells like vacation. That's going in the Christmas giveaway. And the Too Faced Razzle Dazzle Berry Palette. <sighs> Sorry, allergies. They're gonna get worse next week. I like this where it's like all quiet in the house and y'all can hear me and see me and not having to worry about a kid running back and forth. Possibly naked. Okay, and the next thing is I got the damn girl mascara. And that's gonna go on a give the Christmas giveaway. And with that, I got a free makeup set. Um, Magic Must Haves Makeup Set by Too Faced. Um, the Better Than Sex Mascara part will go in the giveaway. A giveaway of some sort. The Better Than Sex Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner will go in a giveaway because I don't use liquid eyeliners. And the Hangover RX Replenishing Primer will go in a giveaway because it's not really my cup of tea. And this I wanted to try. This is the Apricot in the Act. It's a little mini of their duos. I like that I could try it before I decide if I wanna buy it because every once in a while, I think I wanna buy it. Mm, it smells good. It's a blush duo, but that one looks like it has a highlighter, that gold. We'll see. And it's probably not the same as if you bought the big size. All right, I saw that Makeup Revolution had a translucent setting powder. So I, of course, since it's, I believe this was under $10 or under, at least under 20 and I already got my fingerprints all over it. It's plastic, which is good, but it looks so luxurious. Look at that. And then when you open it, you have the mirror and you have, this is covered. I'm not gonna open that because once you open that, you only got 12 months. So until I'm ready to use it, I'm not opening it. But there is that and it's got the little thing. So this is talc free, no flashback, and water resistant. We might have to open it sooner than later so we could test that. All right. And this is bigger than my other powder, so it's gonna sit up there for a little while. Um, I got the Pore Blur, Blur Prime Primer by Makeup Revolution. And I just wanted to try that one. Someone said they wanted me to do a video with the Mermaids Forever palette. So I bought the Mermaids Forever palette. I'm trying to open it right now. I told y'all I read your comments and I do get to it. I couldn't find it at first. I'm trying to take the plastic off of it. There we go. Well, I thought there we went. I believe this was 10 or $12. It may have been 15 Hopefully I got it right. I could have sworn it was Mermaids Forever. <laughs> and it's in another set of plastic. Yay. Okay, this one has a opening. Okay. All right, let's see. 
go ahead and open it. This looks familiar, but I don't remember having it. So I will double check and see, but I believe I haven't had this one, but I will be doing a look with that or giving my opinion on it. And this one is the Reloaded Hypnotic. And I believe this is a dupe for the Sultry palette by Anastasia. I'm gonna compare the two. And if it is in fact a dupe, I will do a video so you can see the two side by side. All right. Last but not least for buying so much money worth of Makeup Revolution products, I got a Makeup Revolution mystery gift here. So, first two things is lipstick and Enchant and Vice. Orange and purple. These might go in the October giveaway because that looks more like a Halloween kind of thing. Or I might stick them in the September giveaway so that they have them for Halloween. That's probably what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to stick these in the September giveaway. Because those are not my colors, but they are perfect for Halloween. In fact, I was actually looking at the um, Wet n Wild website today. They have a lot of stuff for their Halloween thing this year. Okay, this is a Makeup Revolution Pro HD Powder Contour Kit in Fair. I'll have to look at this this is something that I don't see putting in a giveaway unless it's something I stick in there later after I know the skin tone of the person because these are some really light contour colors so I'll have to see what I'm gonna do but I have a contour palette by them I don't think it's this one and this is the makeup revolution redemption eyeshadow palette essential day tonight this will be going in a giveaway either Christmas or November. I might start the Christmas giveaway in November so that I could end it like at the beginning of December and actually send it out to people. We will look and see. But there's that. I didn't open it. I don't, yeah, it's still taped. So this will be going in a giveaway. And the last thing is the Flawless Foils Effect Luminum. It's got a liquid and then it has a foiled eyeshadow. I am not sure how this works and I don't know. I don't really wanna open it in case I decide just to stick it in the Christmas giveaway because that is a pretty color that would be perfect for Christmas. This is in Rival. See, wouldn't that be perfect for like Christmas time. Let's see the directions. It's a primer base. This is a primer base. Huh. Intensifying primer. I might have to look at someone using that. I don't. I have so many liquid eyeshadows and so many other things. I might just say, you know, it's not worth the effort to look into it. And I would like for y'all to have something. I mean, because that is really beautiful. So, you know what? I made my mind up. It's going in the giveaway. So, that is everything I got. And the giveaway pile. Let's see, Christmas giveaway. So far. And there's still a box that I haven't shown you some of the stuff that's going in there. So, I don't want to show you everything because I figure it kind of ruins the surprise when I do the video. So some of the stuff I'm keeping secret, I just stick it in there as I buy it. So I will see y'all in the next video and I hope y'all are having a wonderful week.